Hello, YouTube. This is my first uh, video in quite a while. Great. Well, this is just freaking great. You know, I mean, I'm looking at the preview, right? And it's all like, you know, I'm talking in perfect unison with myself. And now it's lagging like crazy. I don't get it, man. This isn't an old computer. It's a, it's a good computer. I mean, it does, it's not even a big modem. It's, it looks like your everyday average computer. I mean, I, it should have enough uh, space to do this. I don't get it. Well, who cares? <laughs> I don't care if it's laggy or not. It's just the fact that, you know, I'm making a video for one thing. First thing I want to talk about is the big fall in the US dollar. The dollar has become very small in this new freaking messed up economy. And now that I live in Alaska, I can get Alaskan, I can get uh, Canadian money if I wanted to. That's funny, isn't it? Yeah. Huh. Oh, and now that I live over here, uh, my uh, mother's new boyfriend, you know, was I gonna do that? Yes, it was milk. Milk. Okay. Milk. 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 Was not a white Russian. No. Okay, you got me. Jeez. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Well, first of all, I'm going to talk about the new Motor Trend magazine. I got this back in Oklahoma before I went on a plane trip to Colorado and then Alaska, so this is my last memory of Oklahoma. <laughs> Motor Trend magazine. Bling, 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 bling. So, Motor Trend magazine. And I've seen the whole freaking book, and it's pretty cool. My country is a very sweet land of liberty. Why don't you do that in a Russian accent? Anyway. So, anyway, I was wanting to show you guys uh, something that I found in here. This. The, uh, the new going. Now, of course, my grandfather, his favorite car is the old Gullwing. So, I showed him this, and he was like, just about had a heart attack. Oh! <sighs> Skadoosh. So, anyway. That was what I was wanting to show you, that new SLS AMG. Number two is the Prestige Edition Modern Warfare 2. Night Vision Gaga! These are real night vision goggles, but they are not, uh, they don't actually take in light. They make in their own light. So I'm going to show you what they look like. They are, uh, you know how in the movie Step Brothers, they're like, they aren't that noticeable on your face? Well, hold on, what's that? <laughs> they're actually really not that noticeable, you know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, definitely not noticeable at all. Yeah, this is just so amazing. I just, I mean, it's like they're just about the size of a pinprick. No one even knows that they are there. It's amazing. So, yeah, these are night vision goggles. And they come with a copy of Soak of uh, soap, yeah, little, a little bust of his head, with his weird faux hawk, so, yeah, so anyway, 
fall in US dollars became really big and this government is getting really weird you know I don't even know what the heck Obama says whenever he's talking you know because a uh, quarter I actually just made up this joke and it's actually really funny because I made it up last night right before I made my video I was just about to make a video last night but I had to go to sleep I mean, dude, it was 5.13 in the morning. What do you expect? Don't be like, ah, oh, you have a bedtime curfew, fag. Jeez. No. I stayed up until like 5 o'clock, and I was just like, if I don't get sleep, I'm going to die. <laughs> so. So, I went to sleep, and I didn't make my video, so I'm making it right now. Let's do this. Okay. My joke that I was going to make is the fall in U.S. dollar. There we go. There's Mr. Washington. Mr. George Washington. Yes. Dang it, why do I have to do that in a Soviet accent? I don't get it. Can't I just do it in some kind of southern accent? Or? Crocky, maybe I could do it in an Australian accent. Or I could do it in a Scottish accent. That would be nice. Yeah. Irish accent. Don't forget Jamaican man, Mr. Washington, bruh. Yeah, bruh. So, yeah. As I was saying, here's my joke. I was gonna make this. The, uh, let's say a reporter asks Obama, okay? She's like, Mr. Obama, what is your plan for Iraq now that the troops are gone? And of course, he never pays attention. And of course, I am a conservative Republican, mainly just Republican, but I am a little bit conservative. So, anyway, that's just my opinion. I mean, of course, there's going to be those trolls that are Democrats or liberals or whatever, like, fake it. Uh, he's so gay, because he's a, he's a Republican, he's conservative, he's gay. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Yeah, totally. Oh, by the way, that reminds me, you know Nicki Minaj? She is scaring the crap out of me. I mean, she's constantly twitching, you know, in her videos. She be sitting there and like, like uh, in in Sean Kingston, uh, feel like letting go. Da di da di da di do do. You know that one, dude. She's wearing this weird freaking outfit, and she's constantly doing that thing where she's like. Eh, da, 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 da. It's like she's about to have some kind of epileptic seizure on the stage, you know what I'm saying? We'll be sitting there watching the video and then she'll be like, And this is a <laughs> Seriously, it scares the crap out of me. Or seriously, I mean, she she's not even that talented either. I don't know about you guys, but she's just pretty much sitting there just talking. And the guys are just kind of making it sound cool but that's pretty much all she's doing she's just talking to a beat she's not even singing i want to actually hear her sing my country tis of thee how about that i want to hear her sing that i bet you she'll just be sitting there my country tis of thee sweet name of liberty and all they'll have to do is just auto tune it and crap and it'll sound like my country, liberty, you know, all that crap, you know? I mean, all this crap, Katy Perry, I I don't even, I don't I don't know what this world's come to. You know, sometimes I just want to beg for humanity. Sometimes I just want to beg for humanity. You know, whenever I hear her sing, <laughs> whenever she made her uh, I Kissed a Girl and then sang it at the VMAs, I was sitting there like, kill me, please. <laughs> Do you guys remember the VMAs, man? The VMAs, whenever she performed her song. And then she did California Girls. She's been working on it. It sounded, it sounds a lot better from whenever she did it in Katy Perry's. In I Kissed a Girl, sorry. And, you know, jeez. But California Girls and uh, I Kissed a Girl, big difference when it comes to the performance. But uh, other than that, it's been pretty bad. So, yeah. You can travel the world, apparently, but apparently nothing comes close to the Golden Coast. I mean, 
Once you party with us, you'll be you'll you'll be falling in love. Oh 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 oh. I mean, California girls, they're undeniable. You know, they got their Daisy Dukes, bikinis on top. Sun sun gets getting so hot, they're gonna have a love uh, melt your popsicle. She did that. I had to I had to do that because at the freaking song, if you look at the music video, she goes. Sun dress skin so hot the way up high school and then she goes <laughs> What has this world came to? So pretty much that's it. I wanted to show you the night vision goggles. And that's pretty much it. And if there's anything that you want me to talk about, uh maybe next uh tomorrow, the day after, any day. Mainly I'll just be doing my uh, vlogs on Fridays or any day that I'm available, you know. So, if you want anything, you know, uh, message me and I'll be sure to bring it up. And uh, I have a little really funny thing to show you guys uh, next time I come. So, that didn't sound right, next time I come. Anyway, next time I make a video, <laughs> I'm not gonna redo this. This is just, you know, this is coming off the top of my head. This is what YouTube is about. YouTube is not about, you know, making a mistake and then going over it. YouTube is about, you know, having fun. You know, like Shane Dawson. I mean, he tries over and over again. That's because, you know, he's famous. I wish I was as famous as him. I wish I had a sliver, an 18th of how famous he is. So, yeah. Don't forget, the U.S. dollar is messed up. So before I go, I'm going to do my Barack Obama joke, and then I'm going to go. Here we go. Okay. A reporter comes up to him and goes, <coughs> Mr. Obama, what is your plan for Iraq now that the troops have left? And of course, he'll never stay on the subject, so he'll be like, Well, uh, let's explain it this way. Let's say you have a car, and it's low on gas. You buy this car, right? You buy it at a, a Kinko's, and some guy, a hobo, stole it and selling it for cheap, you know? Yeah. yeah. So, you get this car, right? And it's low on gas. So, you go uh, to a gas station, and you're, you, you, you refill the tank. You go up there with your Slim Jim fat stick and your Mountain Dew, and you buy it, and then you ask them, do you have the blueberry cake donut holes anymore? And and the guy at the cash register says, no, we do not have those anymore. So you just throw in a cosmic brownie on clearance, you get that, and then you buy $20 in gas. Okay, so your uh, car, you come back to it, and the needle is like, you know, kind of a little bit more up, you know? So, you just decide, you know, well, why aren't they selling the blueberry cake donut holes anymore, right? So, you call the company, and they say, well, because of nothing about Obama, Obama is a very nice man, nothing about Obamacare, Obama, or the health care bill that costs about $800 million, uh, because of Glenn Beck, Fox News, farming, aliens, and just plain media, we have recalled those donut holes. Uh, so you just say, okay, and you go buy a Slurpee. Which reminds me, he is the very first, uh, what's it called? Very first president, what's it called? What, what? Did I just seriously say, what is a president called? You know, like, oh, what's the word? What's the word? Oh, yeah, quantum mechanics. That's right, yeah. So, anyway, he's the first president to ever use the word, the word Slurpee. That just makes me want to cry for humanity, really. I think that's why I'm going to make this, this show called Cry for Humanity. That's it. I just made it right now. Cry for Humanity. Episode 1. Goodbye, people. Wow.